My name is Raina, and I run Quinania Farm. We're located in Stevenson, Maryland, and our new farm is located in Randallstown, Maryland. We are Maryland's oldest organic farm, and this past year we opened up our new facility, and we now are able to grow almost year-round. We grow culinary herbs. Um, when you go into the grocery store in the produce section and you see prepackaged fresh herbs, um, most of the time they come from us if they're local. And... Um, we have a wide variety, basil, mint, oregano, sage, marjoram, the list goes on and on. We have about 12 different varieties and two different blends, and we're 100% organic. Everything's grown either in the ground in pots, and we do cuttings, so we can go back every week or so and take new cuttings, branches or sprigs off the plant, um, and use those in our packaging and it allows the plant to regenerate and we can reuse that plant over and over again. It can be a little challenging. Um, there are things like basils prone to downy mildew and that are harder to control. You know, there's not as much heavy equipment. You don't need as much land. The growing requirements aren't, aren't as much. You don't have to use as many pesticides and different inputs to get get good results. We harvest the day before it goes to the warehouse and it's on the shelf, you know, that day or the next day. The quality that we have, you know, it costs us a little more to grow, but you know, you could go into a store and compare our herbs to other growers and, and they just don't compare. They're fresher, they have more flavor, um, especially, you know, the varieties that we grow in the ground. And, uh, you know, we don't, use as many inputs as some others. We uh, try to use more biological inputs um, to avoid, you know, pesticide use and, and fungicide use if need be. We just sell under our brand, Quinania. Um, and like I said, we're based right in Stevenson and our new farm in Randallstown right down the road. So the name came from the original farm where we grow outside and um, it was originally the Quinania Foundation, which was a predecessor to the Peace Corps. We'd really like to expand to a few more stores. Um, we're, we're in pretty high demand now. I mean, we only sell to two. We have some other stores that are interested, um, but we, we have to up our supply cause to make sure we can meet their demands. <laughs> so we'd like to expand. We'd like to use more renewable energy sources. We're trying to be as efficient as possible. Um, maybe input some solar, you know, more natural ventilation on our greenhouses. Don't be afraid to open up the package when you go to the store and inspect what's in there. And don't be afraid to ask produce managers if they have anything else in the back. Sometimes they're not the greatest of, you know, bringing out the new stock, but they have it. <laughs>